Prior to working for Royal Caribbean, I had never been on a cruise. But I never thought, growing up in Wisconsin, that there was even an industry of building cruise ships. You don't think of that when you are not surrounded by oceans. So when I was 18, I joined the Army. I was in the military intelligence doing Morse code intercepting. Then when I got out of the military, I went to school and I got a computer-aided engineering and design degree. Then I went and worked for Caterpillar in the design department, in the CAD department. I then worked for a pharmaceutical manufacturing facility. I came to Royal Caribbean as a program analyst for the OASIS project. With Oasis being delivered, we then went on to Allure, where I took on a bigger role in special projects. Denny's was fundamental in, in uh, organizing all the special projects on Oasis and Allure, has been working together with us. That was a big part of, of, of Oasis project. Once we got done with Allure, I moved on to the revitalization side. Came back to the new buildings, worked on the quantum class, and then got Oasis 3 and Oasis 4 as my own projects. This is the best feeling, knowing that everything I do culminates into a big ship. The nucleus of the leadership team is a very strong program manager who makes sure that we stay focused on timelines, that all the information from us is timely delivered to the shipyard. Harry Goulevar is my role model. He is fearless, he gets the job done, he knows what he knows, and he's not afraid to tell you what he knows. As a leader, that's really an important aspect of the job. If you put the effort in, the rewards will come. The recognition will come. The opportunities will come. And my goal since I started was to become a project manager of a new build. And here I am. I'm very, very pleased to have Denise as uh, one of our, our senior program managers and, and helping us. It is exceptionally important that each individual project has a leadership process which is very independent and is running on its own. Everything that I've done basically since I was 18 has been in a male-dominated industry. I think that my military background has really helped me to stand on my own in, in that environment. I enjoy thinking of what will it be when the guest walks on the ship for the first time. What will that experience be for them? And I like that feeling. I like knowing that we make vacations, and I couldn't do it without the love and support of my family. My husband, he is the backbone to the family. I relish in the fact that my son brags about what his mom does for a living. Nobody does anything on their own. We all have a support system, whether it be at the office or back at home, and luckily, I have the best of both worlds.